Hey guys, I'm Nathan. And I'm Bessos. Today, we're talking about the parables. Um, so the parables are stories that Jesus taught in the Bible. I brought you something, Nathan, for your teachings. Oh, that's great. What is it? Uh, parables. Why? Because that is what you're talking about, no? No, Bessos, not of parables. We're talking about the parables. Oh, I see. This is much different. Let's sing a song, and I will come back with a better thing for you. All right, kids, let's stand up and sing a song to Jesus. Yay! Kids? Yeah, you can all sit down. Oh, Mr. Nathan? Yes, Bestos? I finally found the thing that I think you were talking about today. The parables. Bestos, we've been over this a bunch of times. Yes, but I finally understand. And I made something for you. Uh, well, what is it? It is a pair of holes. See, you can see all of the kids through the paper. But see? I can also see like this. This is true, but not as fun. And it doesn't help any of us understand what Jesus was talking about in the pair of holes. No, Bestos. I still don't think you understand. Yes, I think I do. I know something that will help. How about we join our friends in the wild woods of Scuppeton and learn a new word? If you look deep in the wild woods of Scuppeton, you'll find a treehouse filled with imagination and wonder. This is Wildwood Words. <laughs> Come on in. Hi, I'm Melly. And I'm David, and today we are going to talk about a very, very special word. Oh, oh, David, what's the word? Our Wildwood word of the day is believe. Whoa! What does that mean? Well, to believe means that you can know in your heart that something is really, really true. Not just the part of my heart that grows orange balloons? I don't think your heart grows orange balloons. Then where do all these orange spots come from? Uh, that's just your fur, Melly. Oh, okay. I want to try to believe in something with all my heart, even the part of my heart that grows orange balloons. <sighs> Melly, we just talked about. I believe that an orange balloon is going to float through the treehouse. What makes you believe that? I just have a feeling. Wait for it. Wait for it. Whoa, you were right. You believed that an orange balloon would float through the treehouse, and it did. I also believe that a blue balloon will float through the treehouse. Whoa, how did you believe all of this? <laughs> I saw Gus blowing them up this morning, and he always lets the balloons go flying. <laughs> By accident, of course, and they always get trapped in the treehouse. Oh, I get it. Now, Melly, there are a lot of things that you can believe in, but there is one thing 
that is better than all other things that you could believe in. Yeah? What's that? We can believe in Jesus. We can know in our heart that it is really, really true that Jesus loves us. I like believing that. Me too. So do you feel like you know the meaning of believe now? Yes. I know that to believe means to know something is really, really true with all my heart. Just like I believe that you're going to jump and get really, really scared. What? Why? Whoa! <laughs> See? <laughs> yeah, I believe that now too. <laughs> oh, this was very good. I think I understand the things better now. Yeah? Well, do you want to put this new knowledge to a test? What do you mean? Do you want to play a game? Oh, I love games! Well, let's play one now. Kids, you can play with us. We're going to join Melly for Melly's Memory Mobamza. Yay! Mobamza! Mobamza! Mobamza by Melly! Hi! I'm Melly, and today we're going to play Melly's Memory Mobamza. How do you play? Well, let me tell you. First, everyone stand up on your feet, not your hands. Now, you need to meet two of my friends. This bunny likes to stomp his feet. Try stomping with us like this. Good job. And this is a woodpecker. The woodpecker likes to make a noise like this. So clap your hands to make a noise like the woodpecker. <gasps> that was really good. Now, to play our game, you're going to have to remember how to make those sounds. I'm going to ask you a question. If you think the bunny has the answer, stomp your feet. But if you think the woodpecker has the answer, clap your hands. Okay, let's try a practice question. Hmm, okay, I got it. What color are my spots? Are they orange or are they green? Get ready to stomp or to clap on three, two, one. That's right, they're orange. Good job, stompers. Now, let's ask some questions about everything you learned today. What does it mean to believe? Does it mean to know something is really, really true with all your heart? Or does it mean to know that your heart is full of jelly beans? Get ready to stomp with the bunny or clap with the woodpecker in three, two, one. That's right, stompers. To believe means to know something is really, really true with all your heart. Now, let's do one last question. What are parables? Are they a kind of licorice tree that you find in the forest? Or are they stories that Jesus taught? Get ready to answer by stomping or clapping in three, two, one. You're right, woodpeckers. The parables are stories that Jesus taught in the Bible. Great job playing Melly's Memory Mobamza. Remember that Jesus loves you, and so do all your friends in the wild woods of Scuppeton. Don't forget it. Bye. Good job, kids, and good job to you too, Bestos. Oh, thank you. I like to do the stomping and the clapping. Me too. And Mr. Nathan. Yeah? I have one more thing I think that will help you in your teaching. Oh, no. What now, Bestos? Oh, let me guess. A pair of scrolls. Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. A pair of bows. Or how about a pair uh, of... Mr. Nathan, it is none of those things, though they are good things. But I have a different thing, which is a pair of goals. Huh, okay. And my first goal is to learn more about Jesus and the parables he taught us. That's great. And my second goal is to ask Jesus to help me remember all that we learned today. Bestos, that's awesome. And one more. Wait, Bestos, a pair is only two. My last goal is to make a pizza while floating on the moon. Wait, what? What? Why would... No, no, no. I am not finished. Make a pizza while floating on the moon with my pet trolls. What? Wait, Bestos... I am still not finished. Make a pizza while floating on the moon with my pet trolls while singing the song that I wrote. Here, listen. On the moon okay, okay, well, with kids, my pizza Thanks for joining us today we to learn about the parables. The Jesus moon, loves you. And so do we. On the pizza Bye. cheese! Yeah, here we go, here we go! One, two, here we go!